Hello, it's just Crafty Chantel and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a demo and unboxing of Spellbinders Card Kit of the Month, February 2021. Let your heart soar. So I'll quickly run through the contents of the package. I think it's probably been on several channels already. So let's see, 10 cards and 10 envelopes right there. Um, nine pieces of cardstock. So a couple of shades of blue because we have to do the sky. Green, white, yellow, pink and purple, my favorites. Metallic gold, can't go wrong with that. And then a hot pink fuchsia. And then it says set of seven dies. So it looks like the die set does this um, hot air balloon. And then some extra pieces, uh, butterflies, decorations for the hot air balloon. And then some paper piecing goes on with that. Uh, then you have your paper pad. This is also very colorful hot air balloons, uh, butterflies or dragonflies. Oh, this is cute. It looks like a planner or maybe a bingo. Oh, very pretty, very pretty. And then it starts over again. What was that? Something caught my eye. Oh, look at those balloons. Cute. So then you have your paper pad. And let's see, we have a stamp set. Sending love, hugs and kisses, a little note. Go where your dreams take you. Friendship is all about the little things. A little bird told me it's your birthday with some um, bird decorations. Then let's see, we have our puffy stickers right here which are more birds, butterflies, rainbows, and flowers. Couple of uh, banners, sequins, chipboard doodle frame. So these you can color in. So, and then there are some gold ones as well. Butterfly embellishments. These always come in handy. I use these often dimensional embellishments so I'm gonna say that's these and we also have I must have missed it. oh die cut shapes let's just, just kind of dump these so we can get an idea flowers tags a couple of phrases hello lovely Lots of tags, hot air balloons, stamps, happiness, birds and butterflies, just as you are. Celebrate, take flight, happy day, best day. So, you kind of get the gist of it. And then you have your foam squares and adhesive tape. So, what I usually do is... um come up with some type of idea of a card to make. So let me just take a second, figure out how I wanna do that and see if I wanna work with this um, hot air balloon. Just seems a little intense. Let's see, that's the balloon. This on camera. The balloon and the basket and here's a decoration in there and these are for the stamps looks like a little note and hugs and kisses. Okay, can deal with that. And let's see. Oh, 
Oh, then here's our bird up here. And then these are so you can add some color over here. Okay, so let me think about how I want to do this. Okay, I think I have an idea of what I want to do. I went back and forth over using the hot air balloon dye because it really just seems so involved. But um, I'm going to go ahead and, and, and try it out, I think. So um, I was thinking about doing like a hot air balloon in the center of the card and then putting some of these other hot air balloons behind it so it's not like it's the only one in the sky um you almost have to use this sky paper like they have in the design but i think i'm going to try to get away with just using like a clear like a blue sky and then offset it with this one and then i want to put this chasing chase adventure as the sentiment on the cover then the second card, which is really more my style, I think, is um, using this gold paper. I can do matting and layering with uh, this green and some white, maybe. And then um, I got some butterflies, the centerpiece. And then I really like this, um, this sticker right here. And then our sentiment would be so very thankful. So I am going to play around with this uh, hot air balloon first and let's see what we can make of that. So maybe just a couple of these. Maybe I have too many hot air balloons. I don't know. I don't really love the hot air balloon. But there's an example using some of the pieces from the Let Your Heart Soar collection. The hot air balloon. was the main die. Do I need to slip in another hot air balloon to prove the point? <laughs> That's probably fine. Um, okay, so there's that one. We'll go ahead over here with one more and we will um, do some. I like kind of like the, uh, the die cuts though. We'll do some matting and layering. All right, that was quick and, you know, a little more my style. 
have this butterfly, but I think with that flower, I don't even need the butterfly. So these are two cards that we made using the um, spell binders. Let your let your heart soar kit for February 2021. If you enjoy this video, please hit like and subscribe. Also the notifications button and you will be notified when I post additional videos. Thank you so much for joining me today. Again, this is just Crafty Chantel.